The round of showers we had earlier has lifted off to the northeast and moved out of our area. We're still seeing uh, plenty of cloud cover out there. There is a cold front that is sitting through western parts of Wisconsin, back through southern Minnesota and into Iowa as well. The main low pressure system is up in central Canada, but there is another area of low pressure that has developed over Iowa. All of this is moving eastward, and this cluster of showers and thunderstorms is gradually lifting up towards the northeast and will provide us with some additional chances of showers, maybe even a couple thunderstorms later on this evening. Temperatures are sitting at 82 degrees in Marquette. It's 93 in Chicago, but notice over northern Minnesota, North Dakota, a little bit cooler. 79 in Duluth, 78 in Bismarck, and that is a sign of things to change, that we will have some cooler temperatures moving in as winds become out of the northwest tomorrow and out of the north over the weekend. A mix of sun and clouds. There will be a chance of spotty showers over eastern parts of the UP tomorrow. Bright and less humid for Saturday. It's going to be cooler on Sunday with those winds out of the north over the weekend. Futurecast is showing us those chances for additional showers and thunderstorms heading through this evening. Then during the day tomorrow, there will be a few scattered showers over eastern parts of the UP, but by the afternoon, we should start to see some sunshine breaking out for western areas, then drying out going into Saturday. We'll see mostly sunny skies. It's going to be less humid. There might be just a little bit more cloud cover moving in on Sunday. Temperatures for Friday will be near 80 degrees in the afternoon. On Saturday, we'll have highs in the upper 70s, even cooler on Sunday. Most of us in the middle 70s, but with those winds out of the north, it's going to be even colder than what you're seeing on this graph right at the Lake Superior shoreline. Then heading into next week, we should have temperatures getting close to 80 degrees by Tuesday. For lakeshore areas of Marquette County, a high of 75 degrees tomorrow with a mix of sun and clouds. Most Mostly sunny on Saturday with high of 72 degrees, only 69 degrees on Sunday with those winds out of the north bringing in those cooler temperatures. 72 degrees on Monday with mostly sunny skies. Then our next chances of showers will move in late Tuesday and also continue until Wednesday. In interior parts of Marquette County, a high of 80 degrees for tomorrow with a mix of sun and clouds. Mostly sunny skies on Saturday with highs around 79 degrees. A little cooler on Sunday, high temperatures in the middle 70s with a mix of sun and clouds. Mostly sunny on Monday with highs around 78 degrees. And then we'll have high temperatures near 80 degrees Tuesday and Wednesday with our next chances of showers moving in. In Houghton, we'll have partly cloudy skies on Friday, a high of 79 degrees, 77 on Saturday, partly cloudy on Sunday with highs around 74 degrees. For Monday, sunny skies, highs near 78 degrees, and then a chance of scattered showers on Tuesday with highs around 80 degrees. In Iron Mountain, there will be just a chance of spotty showers early on Friday, but by the afternoon, we should start to see a little bit of sunshine. Temperatures near 84 degrees Friday afternoon, a high of 83 on Saturday, partly Partly cloudy skies, a mix of sun and clouds on Sunday with highs near 79 degrees. Partly cloudy on Monday with highs around 80 degrees. Then we will have chances of scattered showers Tuesday and Wednesday. In Escanaba, a chance of a couple spotty showers around on Friday with highs near 81 degrees. 81 on Saturday and mostly sunny, a touch cooler Sunday and Monday. A mix of sun and clouds on Sunday with highs near 78 degrees. Mostly sunny skies on Monday and then our next chance of showers will move in late Tuesday and also continue until Wednesday.